the high school reunion brought so many people back together. Mm -hmm. Really. Um, and we finally saw that there's a deep connection in between Alex and Michael. And uh, what does that stem from? What can you tell us about their history? <laughs> <laughs> I think we go way back. I think uh, we were both outcasts mm -hmm. in our own right. Yep. You know, alienated in our own worlds. And we bond. We have a, I mean, I don't know how much I could say, mm -hmm. but we bonded over uh, a commonality in, I guess, music, mm -hmm. uh, guitar, and that kind of got things going, which, you know, everyone will find out, depending on which episode you're on right now as you watch this. Mm -hmm. But uh, I think it was a little bit of like two lost boys kind of right. finding each other and completely different ends of the spectrum. Yeah. Yeah, I think it was like just almost like a unexplainable connection mm -hmm. you know um alex is gay um i don't know that you have a full label honestly i think no. it was just a, a i don't human believe in connection. labels yeah exactly <laughs> i think it was just a human connection which i think ultimately is what makes it so special and almost like magnetic it's mm -hmm. like yeah that's why the entire pilot they're kind of like in this love hate space and then at the end they just can't not kiss you know right. you mentioned like a magnetic thing or whatever do you think that the alien siblings feel that each feel that way about one person that they each have their own person that they've kind of found mm. Mm. Ooh, that's a cool question actually. yeah well it kind of brought, got brought up when i talked to nathan and janine the other week i uh without giving anything away you know as the season progresses i might be i don't know who i'm most connected to mm. interesting um, so Julie Plex said that this that your characters are her favorite ship. I'm just kind of oh. curious how. I think you, Karina said the same thing. Did how she? How you felt about that? I'll take it. I feel uh, honored. Yeah. A lot of pride, mm -hmm. honestly. Yeah. We I had a uh, yeah. We had a. I think we had a lot to live up to because I, I knew this relationship was really important to Karina. Yeah. Um, and we actually we shot the kissing scene the very last day of the pilot and. When we when they called cut and we wrapped, uh, all the women on set were crying. And Julie, Karina, too. yeah, yeah actually, the rest of the cast was gathering around. Yeah, it was the monitor pretty, watching. It was wild. Like, we just felt the connection, and yeah, yeah, it just. I mean, I walked away from shooting that pilot, and I was like, "We're going to get picked up to series," mm -hmm. and I am so happy to be working with somebody like this. Honestly, uh, it was he just made it so easy. Did you two get to thing. read it all together um, before no. auditioning? Yeah. No. no, so we met. When we got when we arrived to shoot the pilot, and you yeah. just had to hope that there would be chemistry between the two of you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I yeah. actually, I feel like the chemistry was so palpable that I don't even remember a time where we didn't know each other. Right. But yeah. that was like eight, seven months ago. Yeah. <laughs> you know, it's so wild. Did, I mean, did you, did you hang out while you were filming a little bit to kind of help make that yeah. seem a little bit stronger? Yeah. I mean, the pilot was a three-week shoot. I was kind of in and out. Um, yeah. So, but yeah, we went to dinner and did yeah. stuff and, uh, but then once we were actually in Santa Fe shooting, mm -hmm. yeah, we, there was karaoke nights and, you know, Opera. We went to an opera. You did? Yes, they have a beautiful opera house. That's amazing. It's like an indoor outdoor, it's really cool. I don't know, it feels like the pilot was almost like a little camp experience for everybody that was involved in it. That's like, exactly. There is, a, there is a weird closeness that you sort of notice between the cast of the show. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. We all were in the same hotel and, you know. The chemistry between the entire cast was very strange. Yeah, how good it was immediately. Yeah. But I feel like that is a really good indicator of like, you know, the, what's gonna actually translate on screen, mm -hmm. which will in turn right. make the fans just like really well, love the story. Uh, the everybody's so generous, mm -hmm. which off screen with their friendships and on screen with their performances when the camera's not facing them, they're giving us everything we still need, need to, to do our best, you know, give our best performance. Yeah. 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 It's a lot of, there's a lot of mutual respect there. Mm -hmm. So let's talk about a couple of plot points that need to be addressed. How much does Alex know about what his dad's up to in the secrets? Mm. Um, the secret alien stuff that he's sort of been working on this whole time, so. Uh, he doesn't know anything about it. That's actually. not good, is it? To not yeah. have any for in Things might change though throughout okay. this season, but he's at like this point, no. He, on it. I mean, at this point, yeah. He just really thinks his dad is a dick, you know, and just, uh, is his main source of oppression and his battle with himself stems from not feeling loved and accepted by his dad so at this point it, it lies there and then it just gets worse <laughs> you know as as the season goes on um so at this point though he doesn't know much about project shepherd 
Okay. He doesn't know anything about Project Sugar. Trevor St. John, fun to work with, oh. right? Oh my gosh. He brings so Oof. much. He's the man. He's, yeah. He's a closet he's, weirdo he's, too. He really is. Super funny. You think he's so intense and he serious all the time? Dry, but he has a dry, dry, sense of humor. dark sense of humor. But he goes there. Like mm -hmm. there were some scenes where he every take it was different, so it was like very intense. Yeah, he likes to improvise. It kept us on our toes.